Hey everyone, Ron from Vertex here. With me is Dave, our product manager. Our Gamut series is one of the most exciting backpacks we've ever done. New to the Gamut line is the Gamut Checkpoint. Tell us a little bit more about this bag. Brand new bag for us. First of all, you're gonna notice it's got a, a new profile. Really slick and a fast, you know, fast look to this bag. So we have the grab handle up on top. We also have a grab handle right underneath here. At the top, nice little pocket to shove in all your bad habits and you know, uh, food items that you wanna grab, quick access to. Keychain fob in there as well. If I go to the side, and the, we'll just go to the back here for real quick. Uh, we have our uh, padded yoke and uh, shoulder straps with a new set of hardware for an adjustable sternum strap so you can move this up or down for a perfect fit. Behind here is the new molded back face. Uh, prevents the, you know, the heat from getting trapped inside of there. And it still has that luggage pass-through handle so it can slide through there. But we can also use this as a ballistic shield if I need to for that Captain America feature. Right. All of our bags are designed to take ballistic panels. And the nice thing is we've also uh, incorporated Velcro openings for that on the inside to make it easier to put in hard plates as well. All of our partners are making these uh, up for us specifically to the size of the bag that we're running. On the inside, we now have Velcro brand hook and loop. So that way, your pouches can attach this and the Velcro actually increases the shear strength. The rapid pull tab looks like a luggage handle, makes it real easy to grip and access to have to open that up. Something else that's new is this weapons compartment, the zippers are now lockable zippers. And that's new on all the weapon compartments for the bags. Okay, if we move to the sides of the bags, we have a water bottle pockets. I know a lot of guys didn't think there was a place to put a water bottle in this, but look at that, it opens right up. This is probably about the largest water bottle you could shove inside of something, right? Look at there, it drops right in. I can come around the bottom, zip this guy up. It seems like it fits perfectly. That's on both sides. We still do a light colored interior in all these bags. And something new for the bag is uh, this rapid access hot pull tab, right? For quick access for guys who are running PDWs and uh, you know, folding uh, uh, ARs, quick access, I can pull out whatever I have up from the inside. And you notice that light, uh, that light gray interior on this one, right? Something else that's new for these bags, this opens up uh, um, all the way, but we have a new padded laptop sleeve inside of this. So the padded laptop sleeve actually has several different functions for us. Obviously, you can put your hydration uh, bladder behind here or drop in a laptop if you need to. But the other nice thing about this is for guys who are running um, you know, rifles in this, this can actually work as a rifle scabbard. So I okay. want to change the, the depth of this. Undo the Velcro, there's three positions. I can uh, bring that out even further, take it all the way to the bottom, and now the rifle sits inside of this, the muzzle doesn't print, and it holds it in place. But for guys who want to run this slick, uh, meaning that they don't want anything that can interfere at all with this, I can actually take this out entirely and completely run it slick on the inside. That's a great new feature. Also, we still have that, that uh, Velcro loop on the inside of this for any of our Tachigami pouches. So I want to throw in an IFAC inside of here. It's going to hold that in place for us. And we've also done a new mesh uh, pocketing for all the mesh pocket bags. So I can still see what's inside of my contents, but it's got a much higher uh, abrasion resistance uh, rating than the previous mesh we used to use. Going to the outside of the bag, we have our uh, shove-it pocket. Great place to act as a dump pouch. You notice how this blouse is out when you need the extra room. But if I want to open this up all the way, it gives me a couple of options. I can undo the G-hooks and attach this to the outside of the bag. And now this gives me extra storage. So if I want to put like a helmet inside of here, uh, windbreaker, shoes, you know, I, I have that extra storage space. If I need to go from a low-vis or covert situation to an overt uh, situation, I can actually take this and hide this up inside the hidden pocket. That tucks away, and now we have access to all that web platform with the hook and loop and the molly as well.